And we are back at Cosmo Canyon. Hold, hold on, let me. Let me burp, 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 burp. There we go. Okay, so we are in. I think this was Japan's home village? Oh, welcome. The people of this canyon hate to compete, so almost everything here are replicas. But that's alright, some of them you really can't use. Uh, this is a little stronger, but. Oh, fuck it. Oh, hold on. Oh, this is normal growth, so I should probably stick with the one I have. Heavy Vulcan, that sounds nice. Let's just figure this out. Let's just run on this one too. Fuck it, let's do this one. Let's do this one. Okay, let's see. Let's see. All right, I'm not in any group. Okay, okay, okay. This music is really good. Um. Yeah, but no, wait, maybe. What? What? Oh. Bugenhagen sealed this door short. Uh, shut. What did he do that? How did he do that? With super glue? You are an adult ass man and you think that this door is closed with super glue because you can't get it open. Um. Hey! I'm on top of the world, Ma! Top of the world! Man, this must be a bitch to get mail up here. Hey, look, it's Jiffin and an old man. Ass Nugget, this is my grandfather, Bugen. He is incredible. He knows everything. Ho ho ho! I hear that you looked after Nanaki! Nanaki is still a child, you see. Please stop, Grandfather. I'm 48. Uh, okay, 48 years old. Ho ho ho! Nanaki's tribe has incredible longevity. So you see, his 48 years would only be equivalent to say that of a 15 or 16 year old boy in human reckoning. 15 or 16? He's quiet and very deep. You thought he was an adult? Grandfather. I want to be an adult. I want to grow up to be able to protect you and the village. Ho ho ho! No, Nanaki! You can't stand on your own yet! To do that, to do that now, would destroy you in the long run. Reaching up into the heavens, threatening to snatch the very stars from the great city of Midka. You've seen it, haven't you? Well, that's a bad example. Looking up too much makes you lose perspective. Ah! Uh, why, why is... Okay, why is the old man on the table? When it's time for the planet to die, you'll understand that you know absolutely nothing. When the planet dies? Ho ho ho! It may be tomorrow, or a hundred years from now, but it's not long off. How do you know this? I hear the cries of the planet. Oh, he's an ancient. Or oh, wh whatever. Uh, um, Max is. Oh, yeah, Max. Alex! 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 Sorry. What's that? The sounds of the stars in the heavens. While this goes on, plants are born and die. What was that? Ho ho ho! That was a scream from the planet! Didn't you hear it? As if to say, I hurt, I suffer. They have come here on a journey to save the planet. Why don't you show them your apparatus? Ho ho ho! To save the planet? Ho ho ho! But then again, I guess it wouldn't hurt to show him. Bogenhagen! So odd looking people are here. What do you mean looking odd? We are the most. Yeah, okay. The whole place has gotten busy all of a sudden. He brought friends too. I'll go get them. Uh, 
Uh, as Nugget, please call one of them. Only three people can fit into Grandpa's machine. Don't worry, don't worry, my machine will run away. Go and invite your friends. Uh, how do I? Well, oh, how, how do I? Do I call for them up here, or...? Do you have some kind of walkie-talkie, or do I have to go through the village and work my way up here again? That would be kind of weird. Can I see anything? No. Okay, no. Um... Oh, what the f- Oh! Okay. I'm a little confused, gotta admit. Wait, now how do I get down? What about this? Alright. I guess I do have to go and get them. Uh, hope. Then we can also discover all the other- Okay, no, I'm not taking you. Taking my old school hustle team. Oh man, I'm so busy, I need more help, Bumble complain. <laughs> oh, let's see, what do you have to say for me? What did they say? Oh, okay. Let's do this. Do this. Yeah, the old school hustle squad. Atomic scissors. Long range weapon. The one he has now is an is a close quarter one. I'm not too f heavy with that earth. Can we exchange that with an elemental and then earth? I guess that's how it's supposed to be. And grand glove. The Tiger Fang! Tiger, Tiger! Ifrit, yeah! Would... Hmm... Would Ifrit get stronger if I combined him with a fire elemental? A uh, fire material? Okay, come on, has to go. Here, over here, the doors are locked, come in. Uh... Ho, ho, ho. It looks like you have them all together. Then let's begin. I'll stand down. Oh, a PowerPoint presentation. Jesus. Wow, it's just like the real thing. Hmm, yes, pretty good. This is my laboratory. All the workings of space are entered here into into this 3D holographic system. Look, look, a shooting star. I don't think that was a shooting star. Oh look, it's uh, oh, fuck, <laughs> it's Leo Ange comic, it sucks. Oh, this is amazing, ho ho ho, yes, it is something, isn't it? You would actually think that this village that was set up to be like an Indian tribe and was uh, down to earth wouldn't have all this kind of fancy technology. 
Well, let's get to the subject. Eventually, all the humans die. What happens to them after they die? The body decomposes and returns to the planet. Not much everyone knows. What about their consciousness, their hearts and their souls? The soul too returns to the planet. And not only those of humans, but everything on this planet. In fact, all living things in the universe are the same. The spirits that return to the planet merge with one another and roam... Roam the planet, okay. They roam, converge and divide, becoming a swell called the life stream. It's the thing that got people super hype at last year's E3. Life stream, in other words, a path of energy of the souls roaming the planet. Spirit energy is a word that you should never forget. A new life, children are blessed with spirit energy and are brought into the world. Then the time comes when they die and once again they return to the planet. Of course, there are exceptions, but this is the way of the world. I've digressed, but you'll understand better if you watch this. Ah, uh, let me just use this remote and go to scene 4 of this epic Death of Midka DVD. Oh my god, it's a giant! So it's basically just the same principles as reincarnation. Spirit energy is the source of life for trees, birds and humans. And not only living things, it makes it possible to form planets. And if that spirit energy were to disappear... Look, I can interact with this holographic thing. Okay. These are the basics of the study of planet life. If spirit energy disappears, our planet will die. Ho ho ho! Spirit energy is efficient because it exists within nature. When spirit energy is forcefully extracted and manufactured, it can it can't accomplish its true purpose. You're talking about macro energy, right? Everyday macro reactors suck up spirit energy, diminishing it. Spirit energy is compressed in reactors and processed into macro energy. All living things are being used up and thrown away. In other words, macro energy will only destroy the planet. The story of the planets and those who live with them. If you want to know more, then you must listen to the word, words of the elders. So, uh, Nanaki? His father's a cow. His father a coward? So that's it. Nanaki's been thinking that all this time. I did not know this. Okay, so I have to talk with the elders? How the fuck do I talk with the elders? Um. Okay, how do I talk with them? Where are they and who are they? Dude? No. Um. You look old. Elder Hago. Ah, here it is. My job is to gather all the legends and the knowledge of the planet and to make a book. Then, when I return to the planet, the children may still be taught about many things. I am a woman, apparently. <laughs> hmm? Oh, we have a guest. Good, good. I know, I know. You came to ask me something, right? Am I right? It's about the promised land. The promised land? So, what do you want to know? 
There's no uh, no one place called the Promised Land, that's what I believe. No, no, it does exist. Mm, you can say that. In other words, it doesn't exist for us, but it did for the Ancients. The Promised Land is the resting place of the Ancients. The life of the Ancient is one continuous journey, a journey to grow trees and plants, raise animals and make macro energy. Their harsh journey continued throughout their lives. The place they return to after their long journey, their burial land, is the promised land. Hmm? Supreme happiness? I believe that, for the ancients, it was the moment that they were able to return to the planet. The moment when they were released from their fate and gained their supreme happiness. At least that's what I believe. I really don't know whether or not it's true. By the way, those that came with you are all at the Cosmo Candle. Are you leaving? Uh, that was very... Okay, hold on a second. Oh. Yo, see, yo, yo. What a boring place, just like I thought. I want to go somewhere. Let's go find some material. Cosmo Canyon, this is where Avalanche was born. I promise my guys someday when we save the planet from the Shinra that we'll all go to Cosmo Canyon and celebrate. Biggs, Witch, Jesse, James. Now they're all gone. Died for the planet. Really? To save the planet? We all... We all hate the Shinra, but is it right to go on? Will they... will they ever forgive me? Right now, I really don't know, but I do know one thing. If there's anything I can do to save the planet or the people living on it, then I'm gonna do it. I don't care if it's for justice or revenge or whatever, I don't care. Ah, I'm gonna do it! Again! Again! Avalanche born again! Jesus Christ, kid, calm down. I wonder how many years it's been. Gosh, it brings back memories. I'm a seat here. I learned a lot. The Elders taught me many things about the Cetra and the Promised Land. I'm alone. I'm all alone now. But I'm... We're here for you, right? I know, I know, but... I'm the only Cetra. Does that mean we can't help? Okay, this is a downer. Hey, Sam, how about you and I? We, we chill eggs. Hey, Snugget. Bonfires are funny, aren't they? Yeah, I, I, they're fucking hilarious. They re make you remember all sorts of things. You know, hey, Snugget, five years ago, it's nothing. No, for, forget it. I'm uh, afraid to ask. What is it? Feels like. It feels like you're going far away. You really, really are you, right? Uh, are you high or...? Yoxi yo yo Long ago, when I was still very small, we were all around this flame. No, no mind. What happened? It's about my parents. When I talk about my mother, I'm full of pride and joy, and that's fine. But when I think of my father, my heart is full of anger. You really can't... You really can't forgive your father? Of course. He left mother for dead. When, when the G tribe attacked, he ran off by himself, leaving mother and the people of the canyon. Come, Nanaki. There's something you should see. Hmm? The, this, the place may be dangerous. Ask uh, Nugget, will you and one other person come with us? I'm gonna take my healer. Well, where the fuck did he go? Also, I'm so happy I got to fucking choose my party just now. Just so I can do it again like five seconds later.